Hello and welcome. Minecraft Live is right around the corner, and that means it's time for the mob vote. We're here with the first mob trailer right now. Poor Agnes has fallen down a hole, and we're about to see the new mob. I'm going to be pausing the video throughout and talking about loads of stuff. There's, there's a lot of secrets and things in this trailer. I really want to like get into a lot of stuff. So if you want to see the full trailer, it's linked down below. But let's get started. And before we even start the video, there's apparently B B armor. This is an armor stand here. Now. This this could be like nothing. It could be um, because last year there was like a submarine and stuff. So these trailers don't always have like uh, you know like hints and stuff. But it could be though. So let's get continue on. Okay, she's so got a flashlight as well. This could also be you know not a real thing like the flashlight. Oh, Hello. New mob. Yo, look at him, dude. He is so he's like so like. Oh, you know, it's funny. You're so cute. Yeah, he is. Like, Are you lost too? Man, I love these trailers. I love the, like the Agnes and Jens and stuff. Let me rewind it, because he's about he's about to start um making a noise, and this is the noise he'll make. You lost too? I don't like so that's the, the darkness. That's the noise we could probably hear in the game. So he, so Agnes says in a second that like he flies to like dark areas, and then he'll make this noise and go nee, and he'll like warn you and stuff. And this is really good about this year. Like this year, last year, like. People were like unhappy with the glow squid winning, so this year they made it so every mob, I'm, I'm assuming, will have a thing that they are all, all like, they can do at least. So at least like it's not like a useless mob like, like the glow squid was. Like, technically, all the mobs last year were useless because they didn't really do anything, and you don't need a mob to do stuff. Like, I like I like that um some animals don't need to do anything in Minecraft. Like, you know, it'd be cool if like the bat could do something, but like, it's cool to have ambient mobs as well, but. Yeah, it's good. It's good now that we, because we're voting on it, it's like really important. And also, because this is called the glare, a cool theory that's come up is that when it, when the original trailer happened and it had the quadromorphic end division, the pillager sound, and the beacon, that was that was like a clue. Everyone was like, "Oh, this is a clue to like what's going to be the the mobs." And since this is the glare, people are putting this with the the end division thing. So most likely the the glare is that. Then there'll be a one related to sound. So there'll be a sound mob. And then the beacon one will probably buff you in some way, like a beacon does. But yeah, let's continue on. Either. Yikes. It's too dark. So there's a noise there. And that could be, like, an actual, like, the next mob. Like, or it could be the warden. It could be, like, or it could just be for the trailer, obviously. Looking here. Let's continue on. Okay. Man, these are so good, these animals. You must be the glare, the really mob that lets players know when they are in an area that is dark enough for monsters. Now, this is huge, actually. Uh, when I first saw this trailer, I was like, oh, you know, the glare basically is like the F3 screen. And the reason why this is really important is because, obviously, you press F3 and you can see if it's like bright enough for the mobs. You know, it's too dark and the mobs will spawn. But if you don't use the F3 screen or you're in bedrock condition where you literally can't use the F3 screen, it's really good to have this guy, like... Hopefully you can, like, the, the one thing I'm, like, with this guy is hopefully, how do you move him? Because if he's, like, because I, 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 another theory as well, this is, before I say that, another theory that people are having with this update is that the glare and the other two mobs are going to be, like, sort of, like, pets type, it's like a pet vote, where, like, the, each mob will, like, give you something, like, will do something for you, so the glare will show you where the dark is, then the next mob will do this, and then the next mob will do something else, like, Sort of like how axolotls will help you out, sort of like fighting guardians and stuff if you take them with you. So hopefully you can like bucket this guy, and or like you know, you know you can bucket him or you can like lead him around easy because like I'm sure like this guy wouldn't really help late game if you have like well it, it would sort of but like I mean like this is more like an early game thing. You find this guy, you take him with you and you light up the caves because later later game usually have lit up most of the caves anyway and you know you have enough torches where you can just spam them everywhere if you're like really scared of mobs but yeah it'd be really cool though for like builds and stuff like you grab this guy you pull, pull him into your build and like oh over here there's like an area that's dark this guy <clears throat> looks like a moss block everyone's saying he looks like also the grouch so it's funny but like he'd be really cool like to see him in the the um Lush caves biome. I feel like that's where he would spawn in. He would spawn in there, and he would be like, um, what am I trying to say? He would. He'd be a really cool mob for that biome. I feel like maybe that's another hint. Like this is the lush cave cave mob, 
Then you have like the dripstone mob that's sort of like in the dripstone caves, and then another mob will be in the deep dark, maybe. So like the, those, like each one will help you out, maybe like that. You know, who knows though? We'll continue on. The glare flies to dark areas for you. Another thing, the glare's a flying mob, which is really interesting. So he like, oh, my computer's making noises. But yeah, he flies around, which is really really cool, and. That's interesting because it's like an actual flying, another flying mob. We all know about the phantom though. The fan, everyone's like sweating, like oh no, flying mob, like the fan, no. But this is a, this is a friendly mob though. I'm just trying to think about this. She does say about a secret base here, and it's like really interesting. This looks like a sort of face right here, like the two eyes and then the the mouth. But like this secret base could actually be a clue. Like I said, I said at the beginning, like the B armor and the t the flashlight and stuff might not be clues because there's like. Last year, you know, with, like, other trailers, there's been, like, random things that, you know, not coming to the game at all. But this secret base sort of feels like it's going to be something. Maybe it's not, like, for the, um, what's it called? For the update, but maybe it's for the trailers. Like, Yens might come in here next. When it gets grumpy, you will Let's know that it's dark enough for monsters to spawn. You can I also... Can, I, can, oh, I, can, I can literally see, like, pranks with this guy. Like, you hide one of these guys in your friend's base. And you just hear him go, nee, 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 nee. Like, you know, just like in the wall. He's just like, nee. Like, you've had a bunch of them all over your friend's base. Like, and he's just like, nee, nee. Just like, nee. It'd be so funny, though. Especially if, like, you have a friend that, like, doesn't like his builds up. You just, like, throw him, throw a bunch of these guys in his house. And he, they're all just, like, everywhere, like, going, nee, nee. It'd be hilarious. Like, this guy is, like, so funny. He's, like, sort of, like, flying spaghetti, like, um, moss below him. You know, it's it's really interesting. I really, I wonder. I think the other two will also be like imaginary mobs, like they made up these mobs. So hopefully, um, I can't wait to see the next two. I want to let's continue on though. So bring it with you and proves once and for all that you can be grumpy and cute at the same oh, time. Look at, cute. look at him go. Will tiny blind. Agnes ever find tiny Jens? Will tiny Agnes ever find? Oh, I love I love these trailers. Whose so lair cool. is this? Yeah, whose lair you... is this? Okay, so that's that's what they said, but the lair. So, it, all the blocks here are normal blocks, you know, copper, redstone, possible redstone update. Like, I'm trying not to, I'm not trying to go too deep into this, but, but yeah, um, I, 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 I usually, like, right now, I don't know which one, like, we haven't seen the other two mobs, so I don't know, I, don't, I shouldn't say, oh, I vote for this mob, this is, this is the one, because the other two could have something really interesting, like, brought to the game, like, I don't even know what they could be adding, but I think each mob is going to have one thing that it, does so that even if you get the worst the worst mob in your like opinion because i think it's gonna be very opinion this year i think it's gonna be more like oh wow this one lets you like show you where the, to light up this one shows you how to do this and this is really good for like new players i hope these mobs actually get into the game at some point all three of them because i know the next two are gonna have like a similar feature and i've seen a lot of comments and stuff on youtube like going oh how cool is this gonna be to add you know for like new players like show them oh this is how you light up stuff you know it's sort of like it's like how they added ruined portals to like sort of show off how a never portal was made because before there was like nothing that like told you in game to make a never portal like you never you, sh you didn't know how to do it you know unless you like looked up a video you know and for people who don't like light up their builds a lot or light up their areas or like light up caves this is going to be really good for them but yeah like that's basically it for the glare mob possibility of B armor I don't know Possibility of torches, more unlikely. I've seen people saying, oh, you know, maybe. Um, <clears throat> possibility of secret areas like this. We do know that the warden in the deep dark, there are like little areas that um spawn in. You know, like little sp areas spawn in that are, you know, treasure rooms. So this looks like it's on the surface though, so the odds of that are like low. But yeah, I, I'm, I'd place money on like the, the glare spawning in the the lush caves because it just looks like a moss block you know it'd be really cool because like the lush caves are lit up so like you'd like walk in there and you just start hearing this uh, uh, this little like village like hum, 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 you know let me go let me go back and find that that noise uh there's nothing else in the trailer here she just leaves the cave uh where does he make the noise it's near the beginning you lost two <laughs> i don't like I love that noise that's such a good that's such a minecraft noise but yeah like you'd find him in the lush cave going, nee! and that's sort of like, because the lush caves are like sort of one of the first caves you'd go into, because the deep dark's right down near the the bottom, so you'd probably find a lush cave with the tree, 
go in the last cave. You have this guy go near in the little area. That's a little bit darker because all the glow areas lighted up. So you'd, you'd find him and you go, oh, he's, he's, he's angry because there's no light. And you put a torch down. Then he goes to another area, but you put another torch down. And he'll like he'll probably lead you into other caves, which will be really cool. I'm really sort of like hyping this guy up. But that's what I think is really good this year. They're like really like done like, oh, we'll do clever ideas. That way you can like think of so many things now. Like I, I saw people saying like, oh, this is like a mob that can work with redstone because it works with light levels because you can have like light levels and stuff, you know. And you have this mob do stuff because it's light levels and make it move around. And I was like, oh wow, like the things think people come up with are so amazing. Like, but just giving it like a basic behavior like that, <clears throat> basic behavior like people like already coming up with so many ideas and things. But that's the glare looking awesome. B armor looking amazing. If, if they add B armor and like flashlights and stuff, oh, oh man, like just I'm, I'm I'm fingers crossed, man, fingers crossed. But I'm not I've not got I've got not got really many hopes up because obviously like this stuff like this big top secret box. No one's talked about this, and this is in the same trailer, so this is obviously not getting added. They're not adding in huge crates with like top secret written on them. <clears throat> and what's in this crate? Maybe there's some like other stuff in there that like. For the next trailers, you know, like maybe Yens will like follow Agnes. Like Agnes, like goes down here, goes up here at the end of the trailer. Yens is like, oh, I'm here. I'm trying to find Agnes. He comes down. The, the top secret or the the noise over here, you know, that's it's probably gonna, the trailer's probably coming out tomorrow. So I should, I should stop speculating right now. Hope you all enjoyed this video. It was a it's really fun. It's my favorite time of year doing the mob vote. I can't wait for Minecraft Live. I love it. I love it so much. Thank you all for watching. If you want to see more videos, more of my stuff, thank you. And make sure to like and subscribe and goodbye.